Are you guys ready for day 96? Let's go! What's up guys? I am Michael McEnany and this is Leo the Hiking Dog. For the last year, we have been planning and preparing for this through hike of the Appalachian Trail. Thank you for joining our adventure. If you're enjoying the journey, please like, subscribe, and turn on notifications. We would be super thankful. Good morning. Day 96. We are up and out early uh, before 7 o'clock. I think 6.42 is uh, when I got on trail. So pretty good morning start. I woke up to uh, Sluggo Falooza on my tent this morning. It was just slugs everywhere. Ugh. I had to take my time to get them all off. And thank goodness I was right by that creek so I could wash my hands because they were super nasty and slimy after getting all those slugs off my tent. But um, I'm feeling really, really dirty right now. Uh, my shirt is dingy and nasty. And, uh, you know, I just I put my clean clothes on before I go to sleep. Uh, and by the way, that uh, my new quillo, my new quilt, worked fantastic last night. It wasn't hot at all, so that was super nice to have. I uh, ate half that sub sandwich for dinner last night, and then I saved half of it for breakfast this morning, so that was also a good choice. So we're on trail. I got 20 planned for today. Um, it is, we made the 20 yesterday, by the way. Uh, I had to go remap everything, because uh, when I chose a regular route in far out, it put me on the blue blaze and on the purple blaze, and I didn't do either one of those, so I had to go back and, and redo the, the, the route and put it all on the AT, because that's what I did. And I think we got 20.2 to that creek, so we got just over 20, which was a really good day. And I got new shoes. Uh, feet are feeling good this morning, probably thanks to the ibuprofen, but <laughs> we'll see how they feel at the end of the day. That's when it normally starts to, to, to give me some, some issues as far as uh, pain and uh, just them hurting. So, all right, we're going to get this day started, start getting these miles in. If, uh, if we get 20 today, there is a, a pizza slash deli that we can actually camp directly behind. So uh, we'll get a nice dinner and um, I'll be able to stay right there and camp there. So that'll be cool. Uh, and yeah, I guess we're gonna see what else the day brings. All right, we're gonna get these miles in. guys we are less than an hour into our day and it's already starting to rain so looks like we're getting wet today I'm not even putting on my rain gear it's too warm I'll just get wet I could use a good rinse anyway uh, I did put Leo's rain gear on though to keep his food dry and make sure that stays nice and dry because we just picked it up yesterday so oh my goodness it's gonna be it's gonna be a long one folks but we're still going to push for the same goal. We're just going to be wet while doing it. I think it's supposed to rain pretty much uh, throughout the day, uh, according to the forecast. If the forecast is ever correct, but apparently it's correct this morning. All right, we're going to keep getting these miles in. guys we've made it five miles in this rain i am completely soaked through everything is soaked there's a little bench here at a, a little wayside so we decided to stop and and uh sit for a minute and uh, eat a snack and not dry off because there's just no 
chance of being dry out here right now at all. And then we're going to hit the trail again and uh, try to still get to the deli tonight. So uh, I'm having a real problem with, uh, I don't know if it's sweat or something dripping into my eyes from my hat. So I've had to take my hat off and kind of carry it. I'm going to strap it to my bag. Ooh, Leo, don't go anywhere. So I'm going to strap it to my bag and uh, just hike without it for now. But um, I think it's just my hat is so nasty from all the sweat and stuff from the last 95 days that it's just coming out of it with uh, with that much rain. Um, but looks like it's going to be just like this all day long, so we're just going to have to put up with it. All right, we're going to finish eating our snack and hit the trail. All right, we got a little reprieve from the rain for now, at least for a little while. We may get some more showers coming, but... Uh, Took a little break there, ate our snacks, and then we're going to push on. Uh, we're still going to try to get to that pizza deli today, so I, I'm, I'm wet. There's just no other way around being it, you know, in this. You're just going to be wet. Uh, you just want to stay wet and moving. Gear's dry, though. My, uh, my pack has been absolutely fantastic. As far as keeping my gear dry, I haven't had any issues with uh, gear getting wet. So hiking in the rain is really not a problem. It's just a matter of keeping my core and my temperature correct so I can stay warm. Which when it's this warm out, you know, it's, it's really not a problem to hike in this type of rain. All right, we're going to keep pushing these miles, guys. I just came upon this telephone hanging on this board. It's not a working telephone, but there's a uh, thing here. It says, Telephone of the Wind. Though I thought I've lost you, I can hear your voice <laughs> in the silent echoes of your absence. You speak to me through rustling leaves, whistling wind, and bowing branches. Though I've lost you, I feel you here. This is my shrine of trees and nature's sanctuary. This is the telephone of the wind. It is for all who grieve. You are welcome to find solace here. Please use it to connect with those of you who have lost, to feel comfort of their memory. May you hear their voices in the wind, and may peace be with you in your losses. Very interesting. Like I said, it's not a working phone, but uh, somebody put it there. So, all right, cool. All right, guys, we are coming up on a lake. And this lake has concessions on the weekends. It's Monday of Memorial Day weekend, so I don't know if that's included or not. But we're going to go check it out anyway. And since I'm already wet, I might as well jump in the lake. You know what I'm saying? Um, I don't know. Uh, if they have vending machines, that'd be nice. Either way, we're going to stop there for lunch. And uh, either eat the food that we can buy, or I'm going to eat the food in my bag. One or the other. And then, most likely, take a little dip in the lake uh, and refresh ourselves. 
for the second half of the day. So that's what we're gonna do. And I got smudges all over my glasses so I can barely see, but my glasses cleaning rag is wet, so it doesn't do much good right now. Uh oh, okay, where are we going? This way? All right, but I do have a couple dry ones in my bag, so um, I will get those out when we get to the lunch spot and be able to clean my glasses so I can see properly. Unfortunately, the concession stand is closed, but they did have a bathroom, so I was able to take advantage of that. Um, I also saw a mirror, and this mustache is jacked right now. <laughs> I'm going to need uh, a day of no moisture in order to get this thing fixed again. But um, I'm going to go ahead and just eat my lunch, and then I'm probably going to move on. Um, after sitting here for a while, eating lunch, I started to get a little chilly, so... Uh, I don't want to sit too long. Um, if I'm moving, I'm good. And when I was coming down, I was thinking, man, I want to go swimming. But now, I think getting completely soaking wet again, maybe not a good idea. We've got 9.8 miles to go. We're going to be camping at the uh, Pizza and Deli. Um, they allow camping out back. And uh, that's where we're going to have dinner. And also, they have breakfast sandwiches at 6 a.m. in the morning. So that's going to be awesome. So we're going to finish eating our lunch here. And then we're going to hit the trail again. All right, that lake was beautiful, and on a sunny day, I definitely would have been diving in. But um, it's, we're gonna go ahead and, and push because we got nine more, 9.9 .9 more miles to go, and I'm supposed to get more rain this afternoon. So we uh, need to go ahead and just stay on trail and try to get as many miles in as we can. See if we hopefully can't get set up before major rain sets in. We'll have to figure it out. I mean, we're gonna set up either one way or the other it doesn't really matter but uh we're gonna push forward so all right we are back on trail now well here's the shelter that's by the lake um this is a really cool shelter especially if you wanted to go swimming on a nice day this is a beautiful shelter it's looks like it's made 2021 man it's really nice <clears throat> But we got to keep hiking, so let's go. six more miles till we get to the deli um, it's been threatening a little bit more rain but it hasn't actually started raining at all so there's been a very very nice breeze that I've been really enjoying because it keeps the bugs off of me without me having to constantly swat up my own head with my uh, bandana so that's been a very nice break this nice breeze if I could keep this weather right here with this breeze Man, I could hike all day long in this. This is nice. 
but um, anyway, we're gonna get to the deli uh, here in six miles. We're gonna set up camp there tonight. Um, we're gonna have maybe pizza or sandwich tonight, and then we're gonna get up in the morning, which is my birthday, and have some breakfast sandwiches for uh, for the morning and then probably load up a sandwich for lunch today or tomorrow as well so it's gonna be a little a lot more of a deli blazing um, here in this section I'm gonna take advantage of uh, all this food that I can of course while we've got it so we don't have it anymore so it's been nice I'm not complaining for sure all right we're gonna keep pushing these miles We just came across the next shelter and it's a very interesting one. I've never seen one like this before, so I'm gonna show you around. This is Ralph's Peak Hiker Cabin. So it's a cinder blocks building. It's got the bunks inside. Uh, it's got a table in here, very nice. Uh, got a nice little uh, station out back, so, and even got some uh, lawn chairs and stuff but there's a privy as well so pretty nice but I'm looking forward to that deli sandwich so we're gonna keep on pushing all right guys we are about three miles out from the deli and the rain is starting so we did not beat the rain but uh, we're still gonna make it there. We're just gonna be wet when we get there. All right, I'm gonna put all this stuff away so it can stay dry. We'll see you guys at the deli. Well, the storm has passed and now I am soaking wet. It was a torrential downpour for about an hour straight. So we're pushing into this deli. I hope they're uh, super hiker friendly because they're gonna have a wet hiker and a wet dog coming in there. <laughs> so, and I didn't even think about, you know, the fact that it is Memorial Day, so I do hope they're open. But I'm not even worried about that right now. I just gotta get there. We're camping there either way. Uh, yeah, so we're gonna make this last little push. Looks like we're dropping down now. So we should be there soon. watch that tree fall from the ridge up there and now it's laying across the trail now we got to figure out a way around it because it literally just fell a minute ago I mean three minutes before I walked down here it, it fell I heard the big old giant noise and watched it fall through the forest now I gotta figure our way through it all right guys we made it to the deli pizzeria but um, it is closed because it's Memorial Day so um, I mean, I could just camp out back and wait for the morning, but uh, tomorrow's my birthday. So I'm going to get a hotel and uh, I'm going to have a nice uh, resting morning and then figure out what I want to do tomorrow for my birthday. So that's what we're going to do. And uh, so I'm waiting for an Uber to come pick me up. And then we got a hotel room waiting for us at the Best Western. So, all right. All right, guys, I made it here to the hotel. We're at a Best Western here in Fishkill, New York. Um, so I'm going to get some good rest tonight. I'm going to wake up tomorrow morning for my birthday and uh, figure out what I want to do. Um, 
probably going to get some hiking in, but uh, we'll see how the morning starts out. But I need to go ahead and get all my clothes washed and all of my chores done, so um, we'll see you guys tomorrow. Yeah.